Hello, welcome, and thanks for joining us for the latest news and the latest updates wherever you are. And while you're tuning in from, we are very grateful. But kind you, don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification button for more of these updates. Minister Tumwebaze is in tears as government closes his labor export company. Once again, thanks for joining us, but let's take more look into some of these details. Ex-Minister for Labor, Gender and Social Development, Honorable Frank Kajiji Tumwebaze, is sending crocodile tears after his labor export company dubbed Middle East Consultants Limited is included in the list of the labor export firms whose licenses have been immediately revoked by the government of Uganda. Addressing swipes of journalists this Monday morning, Agnes Igoye, the Deputy National Coordinator for Prevention of Tra Trafficking in Persons at the Ministry of Internal Affairs named at least seven labor export companies belonging to some top government officials like veteran journalist Andrew Mwenda and Minister Tumwebazi. The implicated companies are accused of violating the rights and welfare of their clients. They include Allied Placement Consulting, Riders Uganda Limited, Middle East Consultants Limited, Ego Supervision Limited, Fly International Jobs, HBM International Recruitment, Sahara Recruitment Limited, and Top Notch Recruitment Services Limited. These are the companies that have been listed to be revoked in doing their work. And the mentioned companies were also accused of evading license renewals as most of them were shielded by the ex-gender minister, Frank Tumwebaze himself. He is said to have misused his office as gender and labor minister to grant operations space to his own firm and those belonging to people of his, his inner circles. Ugandans have been urged not to conduct any business with the implicated firms, and if you see anybody working with these agencies pursuing you, report us, as Miss Ogoye said to the one of the platforms. And they use, and he, she also added on saying that they use social media to recruit you, but don't accept. Be careful, and not everything you see looking good is one. She added, and about. 12,000 Ugandans are exported to the Middle East in pursuit of greener pastures according to data retrieved from the Gender, Labor and Social Development Ministries. Uh, so that is it though Minister Tumwebaze is now in total tears where his labor export company has been closed and not only his company but six more companies have been closed due to some security purposes. Uh, well, that is it for now. We'll keep on updating with this. Thanks for watching. But do one thing, subscribe and turn the notification button. All these updates will come to you.